Hi, welcome to AFTV. I'm just going to end say it like this. We're out of the Europa League. 5-4 in penalties. You've been here for the for the longest as well. Yeah, yeah. How are you feeling? Is it is it a, listen, head down, get back to it, Premier League or uh, Europa League one hurt. I wanted this. I wanted both. Literally, you said it right. I think it's heads down now. We've got to dust ourselves off. Yeah. It was really tough to watch tonight. I'll, I'll be honest, I can't lie. Um, it was a difficult watch. Um, I felt like if you went out in the 90, without the extra time, the penalties and stuff like that, and obviously Saliba and Tomiyasu going off, it would have hurt a little less. Yeah. It's, it always hurts. Always hurts to, le uh, to lose and, and go up any competition. Mm. At the end of the day, like, you want to win everything and compete for everything. But at the same time, I feel like the way we went out today, it felt like there was a bit of collateral damage there as well. Mm. I'm hoping, obviously, Saliba's not too bad. Um, I mean, coming into the game, um, I was saying to my mates, um, Dave and Murray were saying, obviously, you want to go through, but the main thing is to come away injury-free, Palace game, everyone's fit, ready to go. We're in the first 20 minutes, Sodge Law, Saliba, Tamiyasu, both off. Madness. Um, and I feel like after that, it, it made a difference. I mean, playing out from the back, Saliba's quite key to that. That's mm -hmm. why I think you probably noticed that like, Ramsdale was going long a lot of the time. Yeah, a lot of the times. A lot no, of the time. And, and I don't know, I was, I was happy with Arteta's lineup. I feel like it was strong enough to do it. At the end of the day, you've got, to, you've got to rotate. You can't play the same team for 38 league games and then all the cup competitions as well at the same time. But you're going to see some drop-offs. Yeah. And I don't want to, I don't want to like, be too harsh on the players because I know Vieira didn't have his best game. Nelson didn't have his best game, but they've done bits for us. You know what I'm saying? Like When they have stepped in in the past, in the cup, cup competitions, wherever it is, even in the league, yeah. they've done it. So yeah. I don't want to like, sit here now and like, kind of like, oh, start criticising everyone because we're, we're due an off night. We can have an off night. We've got to keep supporting at the end of the day dust ourselves off because Sunday's the big one. Yeah. Sunday's the big one. Yeah, you're not concerned with the home performances at all? A little concerned. I mean, at the same time, like obviously we've been, it's been a fortress since the start. Mm. I know now it's a little bit sticky with the, the goals we conceded and stuff like that, but like I can't really fault the players. It's a young team. Do you know what I'm saying? And, and we, we've been going strong this long. Like it's not easy, like from August up until now. Like I know the last couple of games at home has been a bit sticky, but again, it's a young team. We're still learning. And listen, whatever happens at the end of the season, like I'm still proud of them. No matter what, even I don't want to even manifest and say we won't win the league, but no matter what happens, I'll just say to you, bro, like I'm proud of the team. And I said to you last time as well, how long I've been coming here and yep. I haven't had that feeling. Yep. Do you know what I'm saying? Like shouts to my uncle, my bubble. Like this, yep. this is like literally like that feeling's back. I could feel that in it mm. from, from back then. So either way, whatever happens, still proud, but we have to go against Sunday. We've got to stay positive and keep fighting to the end, bro. Shop for AFTV merch at shop.aftv.co.uk Subscribe to us on YouTube. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, Snapchat and Twitch. We've got content for every platform, so check it out.